<clears throat> Welcome back, everybody. Dren Six Eight plays uh, playing BattleTech here. Um, I rebuilt my Max. Uh, I've got to wait a long time to get a bunch of them back, so we're gonna pass some time here. And we're gonna get uh, upgrade. That work order is complete, boss. Top notch. And Phantom Pain. Passing by the med bay, you spot brother wrestling a medical monitor from a med tech. You need to take a second look. Brother presses a hand against his stomach and winces. I know something is wrong. I feel like I'm dying. You pause in the doorway. What's going on in here? Brother relinquishes the monitor and the med tech clears her throat. Brother's complaints of abdominal pain are purely neurological. Phantom pain, Commander. There's nothing to treat. We've checked. Yes, Commander. I'm not making this up. Take a deep breath. If you know there's an exploratory surgery or another exemption, I know the Metex will find something. Uh, I'll take Brother out if I do an exploratory surgery. I don't know what to do. Uh... Do a second medical examination. Trust your judgment, brother. You turn your gaze to the med tech. You have another examination. Nothing invasive unless it's warranted. Later today, you receive a report from the med techs. Their second examination of brother revealed a large cyst hidden behind his appendix. They had to operate immediately. Respect to the med bay and visit him in recovery room. The medical equipment surrounding him blinks and beeps at a steady rate. How are you feeling? He asked. Brother carefully passed his abdomen. You should have seen this thing they took out of me. You know, the size of a shotgun shell. Well, it's no way for a mercenary to go, Commander. I won't forget this. You saved my life. Gain the following tags dependable. Which, which doesn't... It doesn't tell me that that does anything. Please, in the comments, everybody. If you know what those what those tags mean, do they mean anything in combat? <coughs> Alright, I need to go at least one more day. Actually, six more days. Ready to go over financial oh, whenever you I've, are. Okay, yeah, it's getting expensive to run this place. I know what I forgot to do. I forgot to go do the next ship upgrade. So we're up to 38. Um, I was going down these things because they that's plus one morale. Plus one morale. Plus one morale. So I have to do like three of these. Plus two morale. So that would give me up to forty, and then I only need to do one more. Sure thing. It'll take a bit, but we'll get it done. And I have to do one more to get myself to forty-one, which will get me more. Um, Thirty-five resolve points, which is what I'm trying to get. I want to get more morale, more morale points per turn. And then I'll go back and build up the mech bay and some of his stuff. So, just slowly but surely trying to f outfit the ship completely. Okay. Uh, I guess back here. Um, do I have anything to sell? I don't remember if I had anything to sell. Um, didn't I get a... Yeah, I got one of these. Got SRM twos, a PPC, an AC five. No armor to speak of, and no jump jets. Uh, I think we're gonna get rid of this. So I want to put that in storage, and then we're gonna go to the store. Have done this earlier. Uh, we're going to be selling of mechs. Sell that, get back some of our money. Still don't know how to build a Wolverine. Nobody's left me any notes on how to build a Wolverine. I might end up just selling it along with the Locust and the Firestarter. 
keep these these three and the panther as my backup type thing. Okay. Uh, do I have abundance of ammo? I do have a little bit of extra ammo here. Been keeping ten of each of the ammo types. Like I keep ten in my inventory, or you know, if I have less, obviously I keep everything I can. Uh, but just trying to keep myself at that ten mark for ammo and weapons. I'm kind of doing the same thing. I think I have any excessive amounts of weapons. Nope. Okay. Okay, I made a little bit of money. Let's go back out here and just pass some more days. Okay. Now I could wait another 10 days to get myself and the Zeus back. Uh, what do we got here for contracts? There's this one. It's an assassination. Assassinations usually don't go well for me. Taking the cicadas out, but usually they're, uh, the escorts are usually fairly nasty. Who am I going to make mad at me? The planetary government. So that's okay. What's this one? Who's this thing? Who do I make mad here? Make the Capellans mad at me. This makes the Capellans happy with me. So I get plus eight, and then I take away seven. Okay. The question is, is do I want to do this assassinate? Uh, I don't know. Um, I'm going for the assassinate. I'd have to take the two Jagger mechs, this thing, and thirty two hundred and thirty five tons. a laser boat, right? Laser, some LRMs. LRM-10, lots of medium lasers, lots of lasers. He's a missile boat. The Enforcer doesn't have a lot to talk about. It's got an AC-10, a couple of medium lasers. He wouldn't stand up well. She's basically a, you know, melee machine short range missiles one medium laser two medium lasers okay uh, to show you one of the rebuilds for this um, I rebuilt it some I put an LRM 15 on him I changed this up to an AC-5. I took his armor down to 1,200. So he's not full armor like I usually am. But now he's got an AC-5. 15 shots on the AC-5. Two medium lasers for in closer work. And the LRM-15. So I'm trying to make him a bit more of a sniper. I was using an AC-2, but it wasn't doing enough damage. So I'm hoping the AC-5 will get me some more damage on him using the Jagger mech. Don't have any pilot mods. I really need to go someplace and find pilot mods. But anyway, that's what I did with the with the, uh, the Jagger mech missile boat. It's not really a missile boat anymore. And 
And then the next one that's going to come up is going to be the Zeus and then the Catapult. Try to do some things with them to try and make them have a little more punch, a little bit less armor. Uh, for this assassination, I'd have to take these three and then something else. I think I want to take the Zeus. I'm going to wait another 10 days. So boring. Here we go. 10 more days. I know that's a whole bunch of days I'm not making any money, but these are tough missions now. Okay, let's go. Let's go try this assassination. Uh, I could go for more salvage, but I don't. I don't usually do well in these, so I'm going to keep it there. Because usually their escorts are too tough for me and I have to run away. At least the last couple of sessions. Especially on a lunar surface, I've got problems. Because my heat doesn't get out. I probably need to leave this place. That's what I probably should have done is I probably should have left. Okay, Behemoth, you're going to take your your thing. Uh, she's in that Jagger mech. I have Decker in this Jagger mech. Me and this, you don't know what I need to do? I need to go check my mech warriors. Do I have any experience points to spend? I have 6,800. I need 81. Okay. Decker, 3,500. Not enough. Behemoth, 6,100. This doesn't really help you, but it does get you going up there to get you closer. Uh, I don't know. And then glitch, I don't think you have Waiting enough for anything. You, oh, you can get your piloting up. Yeah, the unsteady threshold is what I need for you. So you're gonna do that. Training complete. Um, Receiving you. I'm just gonna go ahead and take her up. Mech warrior training complete. Becker, you need more, and I need more. Okay. Uh, where's Mummy Bear? Commander? She needs to get some serious experience points in here, too. Well, let's just stick with the four we've got. All right, back to our contracts. We're doing this one. There's she. We're going to leave it in the middle. And we're going to take the Kantaro out. So I've got two threes, a two, and a one. Okay, here we go. 13 minutes in. Probably going to be a 45-minute video because these combats take at least a half an hour. Uh, I might have to stop at halfway. I don't know. Let's see where, See how quickly we get this done. Come on. I have a little bit more... Sniping power. I sh oh, I should have shown you the Zeus before we went down. But you'll see it when I pull up myself. Oh, come on. I did something similar with the Zeus. I think I put in an AC. No, not an AC. What did I put in there? Oh, a large laser. Along with his missiles. So he has some decent long range firing. So I'm. I'm pulling away from my close-in and personal style, and I'm trying to get a little bit more long-range shooting with all my extra armor. Uh, it's asking to be shot. Yeah, we've been to this. Here, go young. Go bastards are fast, so watch the beaver to make a run for it. He's going to run away. I know he's going to run away. Remember that we're expecting very heavy escorts, so it might be wiser to hit the target and run for the LZ. Here. That's what I know. That's what I usually end up having to do. Good luck and good hunting. Because they're going to be heavier than me. All right, Decker. This is a road. Do we just want to run up the road? Let's go see if we can find something. Me. Yep. I got a sensor trace. What did I find? 
a 50 ton mech over the hill there. Okay. Uh, glitch. Uh, you can run up here to get six bars as well. Put the two Jagger mechs over here. Coordinates received. Behemoth with your Kentaro. You're going to run over to this side a little bit. I'm really trying to find the cicada. On my way. And then I wanted to show you here, what I did is I, I put in some really good medium lasers that do extra damage or have extra accuracy and stuff. It's like this thing does 35 now, this one does 30. The large laser does 40, and then I have my LRMs. So I do have two fairly long range and two medium, medium range things on the Zeus. We're going to see if that works any better. Uh... I have to sprint to here to get six. I'm worried about the cicada tra traipsing off in the distance, so I'm going to go up here. Trying to find some way to get to the cicada. It looks like I'm going to have to deal with uh, an escort. All right, here we go, round two. Okay, uh, what is that? A 65-ton mech. Sixty-five ton is a heavy, right? But he didn't move it at two. I'm really confused. I'm really, really confused. And I know he's up. He's way up there. I don't know which way he's going to move. Ah, oh, bloody heck. That's going to get me into a fight that I don't necessarily want to get into. Right? I don't want to get into this fight. But I can't sprint away from them. Oh, they don't know where I'm at. I mean, they know I'm out here, but they don't know what I am yet. So they can't shoot me yet. Oh, man. Yeah, it didn't go the way I wanted it to. Do I go up here and see what these are? I'm curious what that 65 ton is. All right, we'll go up here and we'll sensor lock something and see what we find. See how bad it is. Uh, let's sensor lock the big heavy one. He's got a 45 ton, a 50, so that's 95. He's got 160 tons here so far, so there's going to be more coming. Let's see what he is. What is he? He's a thunderbolt. Okay, well, they get a three to move. An enforcer. I have one of those. Oh, jeez. He's good. Are you done? Not much armor left in that location. But did he take out your whole freaking leg? What did he hit? I don't understand. Why does he say he doesn't have much armor left? I don't... Oh, he took a big hit in the chest. Okay, Jesus Christ. He's got three bars. He's got one. He's gonna go. There's another three that's gonna go, and she can't get anywhere near him to do anything. Yeah, she can't get anywhere to do anything. Uh, 
know this is bad. This is very bad. She can sprint up to here. Acknowledged. Yeah, sprint her behind the hill so that she can jump up on top and shoot down, maybe. I don't know. We'll have to see. Now there three will go. Got another three at least. Oh jeez, it's got a It's got something with a PPC in it. That's gotta be like a vindicator or something. Alright, uh glitch. Waiting for orders. Yeah, you can only move to get you can move here to get three. You this is bad. Go. Very bad. Yeah, he's a vindicator with three bars each. He's got one bar. Two AC fives can hit him. He's probably got ridiculous amounts of armor. Yeah, he's he's ridiculous. Thunderbolt's ridiculous. All right, uh, she's gonna split fire. He gets the thunderbolts, and we'll shoot the. Oh. And then the lasers hit him. And she'll have the lasers fire over there. Uh -huh. She did a little bit of damage against him. And a little bit of damage against him. Now his thunderbolt's going to go. Oh, he's got another 65 ton mech. He's got two of them. He's got two thunderbolts. Yeah, we're outmatched. I still have to go get the cicada. Zeus. I can't move anywhere and do anything. Can I jump up here and get some bars and maybe hit somebody? Maybe try to hit that one thunderbolt that doesn't have any bars on him. Oh, for the love of God, why does it do that? I can only hit him there. So what if I multi-target, hit him with the long-range stuff, hit him with the short-range stuff, run up my heat and see what happens. Not a lot. Now that Thunderbolt's going to go and blow us up. Okay, let's go. Okay. Thunderbolt's moving at a three? He must have like a pilot? I'm under heavy fire. How does he have such a good pilot? Scout, he's kinda like Decker. Alright, um, yeah, Decker, we're in trouble. I want to go find the cicada. I don't want to do this. Receiving you. Yeah, he's dying. He's got to get out of here. They're just going to kill him. They don't miss. Oh, I'm going to lose my Jagger Mix. I'm going to lose everything here. Um, sensor lock that one. Got a lock. Another three goes. Forcer. I got to do something about him. What is he using? I 
How can they hit me so hard? Order. She's going to get hit by everybody. If she goes here. Firing jump jet. And unleash on this guy. Oh, got a head hit. Didn't change his. Wow. He just won't well, miss. Easy on the armor, buddy. He's an ace pilot, so he gets to shoot and then move. This is bad. Glitch is about to add too. Commander? Yep, she's she's gonna lose her AC5 armor ammo. Cause I can't do anything. You gotta jump over here so you get bars. And shoot this guy. Come on. Oh, jeez. He's so hard. Can I try and take a headshot? I think I have to try and take a headshot. 17% chance. But I'm not going to use the lasers. Okay, one of those heavies is down. This one's going to come up and shoot. Oh, stop. Stop eating up my pork and taro. Armor breach, internal damage. What? I'm so confused. Okay. I do 200 damage death from above on him. I don't know if it'd be enough to take him out. Could try to do a headshot on him. I don't know if I'm going to get that lucky again. <clears throat> My armor looks like here. Oh no, I take I take huge amounts of damage there. Can't do that. Um, I move up to here. I get two marks. This guy's got lots of evasions. Just go for the headshot with all with everything. Missiles included. Structure exposed, but I didn't get him. Okay. And then he's going to move. That's fine. You can do that. We'll take care of you in a minute. What does this guy look like? That's his AC-10 ammo. Can she punch him? Receiving you.
Do I want to punch him or do I want a death from above him? Just get rid of him. He's the fastest thing I've got, though. Pecker, where are you? He's going to go after you, so I have to... I have to have her do it. She either comes and punches him. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to do that. Moving out. Putting my weight into it. That didn't do anything. Didn't do anything. Now he gets to move. Oh no, did I take him down? It's down to a two, huh? That means Decker. Yes, Commander. Uh, if I have you move here. Or do I just want to have you destabilize him? Okay, I'm going to take a chance with Decker. It's probably a bad thing to do. And hit him with everything. Do I want to try and take his head out? No, he can't do headshots. He doesn't do good on headshots. No, he just wants to attack him with everything. Giving him everything I've got. And didn't get him. The Thunderbolt goes and blows up Decker, probably. Yep, because they can kill Decker. I'm gonna kill Decker. Reporting heavy damage. Okay, glitch. Waiting for orders. You move to here. We're gonna try and get this guy. Gonna have you do another headshot. Got it. Yeah, I missed his head altogether. Jeez. God. Why do they always pick on Decker? They're trying to they're gonna kill Decker. Internal structure damage. Yeah, I know. We've got to get you out of the battle. I'm just going to go punch this thing. I got too much heat. Uh, yeah. That's good enough. It's too much heat for me. But I didn't kill him. Didn't destroy him completely. I didn't get his... So why does he get to go first? I have two threes. Why does he get to go first? Not fair. Okay, you're going to take off this guy's bars. This guy gotta go. Alright, Decker, you gotta get the heck out of Dodge. And you're just going to sensor lock this guy. I've got a sensor lock. Uh, it should be Behemoth. Standing by. All right, what's this guy? He's a two. He's a two.
could have her shoot him from behind. <laughs> Look at that. 105. 210. Hundred and five. Well, I can't do anything to him. I could blow this guy up. I could go try and take out the Vindicator, too. I don't know what to do. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what to do. Let's try and take out the Thunderbolt. Well, actually, if I take out the other guy, it's a free called shot, isn't it? This is a free called shot, 90% chance. And he's got 11 left, so I don't even need to use my SRMs. And do this. Either one hits, he's dead. Copy that. Target That's... neutralized. And again, he gets to go before me. I don't understand how this initiative thing works, but he's gonna punch her. And machine gun her. I'm getting whacked up here. Okay. He's got two. He's got one. So we want to get rid of the Vindicator. Good to go. He's like totally untouched. Oh god, look at this. She's totally getting wrecked. We are totally getting wrecked. Oh. We are getting wrecked. So this is the left torso, has LRM-5 and LRM ham ammo, which will take out the left arm, which has a short laser. This one has just heat sinks, but it'll take out the PPC if I get this. It's got 135. This one has, see that's the left torso, I want the right torso, so the right torso as if I hit it with everything I might get it alright all got rid of that PPC and pilot is injured knocked him down to a 2 okay knocked him down to a 2 Zeus Could death from above him, but I don't think I want to do that. Uh, I want to move a little bit away from him so that I have the ability to just unload everything on him from the rear. Just see what happens. Oh, that takes up my heat, but I don't care. It's go time. 
All right, Vindicator is a two. He's a two with stuff. So I need to get Behemoth, where can you get to? Good to go. If I were to have you jump, you could jump right up on top of him or right up on him and blow one of these guys away. Okay, so if I had you jump to here, then you could blow this guy up. Right? Uh, maybe not. Uh, that's a lot of evasion bars. Hit him with SRM6s and try and knock him down. We'll jump up here. I don't think we can shoot everything at him. Yeah, that's way over. Even the SRM6s take her over, so you can only shoot one of them. All right, uh, not a very good shot. Yep, that didn't work. Decker. Waiting for orders. He's trying to jump away from the battle. And then I'm going to have you uh, LRM this guy. Roger that. Left leg destroyed. That should knock I think him I down. Did something good. So he's on initiative one now. So then there's Thunderbolt gets to go. the Jagger mech. Right torso and right arm. Alright, glitch. Commander? Uh, you gotta try and kill this guy. Right? You gotta try and... Oh, come on. You gotta try and see if you can take the shot on that guy. Oh, he's not touched at all. That's got 102. I mean, go for the headshot. 16%. Go for the headshot. Here we go. And didn't get him. Damn it. I don't ever get him when I need to. <coughs> Structure exposed. What? Damage. Jesus. I got too much heat. Uh, let's go try and kill the Vindicator. I'm going to vigilance myself. And then I'm going to try to punch this guy. From over here. Actually, I can punch him from behind. Let's punch him from behind. Maybe I can kill him. Okay. One less mech to worry about. Mech warriors, show them what you got. Okay, there he is. Here he comes. Here comes the cicada. We got to get rid of this thing. This guy's got lots of heat. 
Ready for order. Decker. I think I'm just going to have you lay down a bunch of missiles on him. Because you're so damaged. Does he have any vulnerabilities in the back? A little bit. Still 120. Jeez, Pete! Yes, Commander. She's got a head exposed. I'm gonna death from above him from behind. Copy that. One less target. Okay, he's down. So now we gotta go chase down the. Good to go. Now we gotta go chase down the uh, the guy. She's got a sprint. Oh god, I gotta get up to that top of that hill. I don't know if I can jump up there. But we'll see. And then the Zeus. And I'm. Oh, I should have. I should have. Damn it. I keep forgetting to do that. I needed to move her up. Um, I'm going to sprint myself. Like right to here. Okay, we gotta try and catch that cicada now. He's moving that way. Okay, Decker, Standing can by. you just sensor lock him from where you're standing? Okay, you can sensor lock him, so just go ahead and do that. Okay, here's the cicada. Behemoth. You can't get anywhere to do anything to him. So we're just going to have you sprint like over here. Glitch, we're going to have glitch. I'm going to have you vigilance. Let's see if. God, she's got so much heat. She can't jump up that high. Uh, sprint. She can sprint up to here. Double time. And then me and the Zeus. I don't think I can jump that high. Oh, I can jump up to here and hit him with LRMs. Right? Yep, let's get me up there and then hit him with LRMs. Since I can. Hit him with some rockets. Primary target damage, Commander. I got some kind of structure support. Yeah, we're trying. It's not gonna let me. He moves too fast. Oh, Jesus. Come on. Oh, he's going to get away. He is going to get away. Look at all those bars. Yeah, I'm not going to catch him. Even if I precision strike him, I can't hit him in the leg. Is 
90. Well, I'm not likely to get him, but I'm going to shoot there anyway. Down to 85. Glitch, Commander? you don't have anything you can do. Can't even jump up here to shoot him. Can you? Nope. She can't even get up there to shoot him. We're screwed. I can't get him. Commander. Lifting off. I think he's out of range of even her medium lasers, right? Yep. Yep. Shouldn't have attacked him when I did. Should have just kept moving around. I didn't know where the denial zone was. It's right there and I can't get to him. I can't get anywhere to get a direct shot on him. It's only missiles, but just try and weaken that back. Let's hit him hard. BMF, can you get somewhere to shoot him? You can't shoot him. He's too far away. So she can't get him. Decker's the only one that has a chance. He's got way too many bars. But you gotta try, Decker. You're gonna go here. Precise strike in the rear. Oh, we got him. Barely. That's a kill. No need to get behind us. Oh, boy, that was a tough one. And we're at 53 minutes, so we'll do the after action report here and then. Oh, you. Got an extra 10%. I'm going to need all that money because I got. Everything's just ripped to shreds. Yeah, I am not very good at this. I got one, she got two, he got one, she got one. This is just damage, damage, a little bit of armor. And he's got to be rebuilt again. That Jagger mech's not coming out right. Her Jagger mech is just ripped to shreds. Okay. I have to think about rebuilding that differently, I guess. Uh, go to next. This is where we get our stuff. Um... Well, I've got one of three. Okay, so I need... Uh, no, I don't. I have one, two. That'll make one of those to sell. And this will get me close to being able to sell one of those when I find another one. They don't have any... No plus weapons or anything here. I don't, I don't see any. I don't see anything special. I don't see anything special. No. No. No special weapons or anything. All right, that's what we're going to take. We get 10 more bits. And continue. 
we'll have another mech to sell. Which will help you fed our mech. Okay, so let's go. I tell you what, we're going to go ahead and put a pause right in here. Um, if you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button. If you really like to see, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notify bell. Be notified. Upload videos and schedule streams. Um, we'll take a look at the Mac. I'll probably rebuild my Macs offline and then just pass the time to get up to uh, you know the next mission. I don't know what we're going to take here, guys. Uh, contracts are not looking good here. I'm not liking this... this uh, the space here so I think I'm going to go look what's that oh they just gave me another one who's that against oh that's against the pirates I don't want to mess with the pirates I could go back and do some of these pirate things like here go to Clough stand it's a desert ambush a convoy this one's a base defense against a three stack. I'm not sure I want to do base defense against a three stack. And this is escort. I'm not going to get that done. I could go back here, the cluff stand, and then move on from there. I don't know. We'll have to look at the map. I'll look at the map offline and see if I can make a decision on going somewhere else. Uh, like I said, you know, thumbs up and comments help the algorithm in YouTube. Subscriptions help build the channel. Uh, notify bell keep you apprised of when I'm uploading various things. I have two other unemployed playthroughs going on right now: Rogue Trader and Baldur's Gate 3. Baldur's Gate 3 is sort of in a hiatus as I I found a glitch in their patch seven and they haven't patched it for me yet. They haven't fixed it. So um, and I'm having some copyright issues with their music and the game is being copyright notified on. So I'm like, huh, what? So I'm working on that dispute with uh, YouTube before I publish any more Baldur's Gate 3 stuff because I don't want to have it all suddenly be copyrighted just because they play music in the background of the game. Um, I may have to play the game uh, without music going forward just to avoid all that, which is kind of sad because that's part of the ambience of Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, doing Saturday morning streams on Pathfinder Kingmaker. Uh, it's female monk. Romancing Tristan, it was a fan choice to have me do that. Uh, I think I've completed the, the romance line for Tristan at this point so now I just need to finish the game um, this upcoming weekend as of time of filming of this I will be out for like four days at a con gaming convention in Madison Wisconsin called Game Hole Con uh, Midwest is the uh, Midwest United States largest uh, board game and card game type gaming convention not dealing with computer games it's dealing with the real you know physical games uh, so I'll be disappearing for four days there. I am going to be having a scheduling, uh, trying to schedule up these videos for people to see. So you guys should see this probably through that four-day period. But I won't actually be here to answer uh, comments and things until Sunday night when I get home. And then I'll spend most of Sunday night probably just digging through all the comments and making sure everything's uh, got released and everything on time and going the way it should. So, anyway... Uh, that's where we stand now. Uh, please leave me comments on builds on these things. Uh, like, you know, I'll show you, give you the picture of the mech bay. Come on. This is the Jagger mech that just got ripped to, ripped to shreds. I'm going to have to put an AC5 on it again and some lasers. This guy, he just got, see, he's just got a damage. She's got a damage. I expected that. The Zeus survived. I have one of these, so I need to look at this because this had a PPC on it versus this one, which is like all energy. This one has a mix, so I might get rid of this one and keep this one around as my backup heavy. I don't know. I have to see how to build that. But if you've got any uh, any ideas of building, the Griffin one end I'm going to leave just the way it is. It's basically a missile boat for when I'm like doing an intercepting a convoy. I take him along and with somebody like Decker or Mummy Bear, so they're moving as a four. 
And they have all these LRMs that they can, they go speeding across the landscape, they see the, you know, see the vehicles and they just LRM them before they can even get anywhere. So these guys, this is my speedboat for that kind of thing. And then I usually bring along uh, probably something like the Enforcer that has a decent range, you know, stuff like that. I try to bring things that have decent range to take out the vehicles as soon as I see them. And then the Escorts if we can afford it. But uh, So I got a couple that I'm going to repair and then one that I have to rebuild. I'm going to think about how I want to rebuild that. And then this one here, if there's a better way to build this out than the way it is. So give me some ideas uh, in the comment section, if you would, please. All right. All right. I'm Drone 608. Until we meet again, stay safe and bye-bye.